First, there was Mr. Dimitri. He worked at a company, and they needed some software for people to work together. They needed some software. Yes. So, he is from here. Which continent is this? Uh, Europe. Europe. And yes, this yeah. country is Ukraine. Ukraine. So, he is from Ukraine, and he created the software, and he gave it away to the world for free. That's called open source. Mm. Then came Mr. Sid. He also lives in the same continent. Which continent? Europe. Europe. He lives in Netherlands. Netherlands. And uh, over here. He wanted to start a company, and he thought it would be a good idea to help other companies that are using the same software that Mr. Dimitri made. Mm. And so, GitLab started, and they became a team. I do. So, do you have any questions? Um, is Mr. Dimitri this one? Yes, dead. No, he's not dead. I met him in Mexico. He's still alive. Yes. Any other questions? Um, is, is um, how old is GitLab? GitLab, the, the, the software, Mr. Dimitri, it started about five years ago, but um, GitLab, the company that they both started together, about three and a half years old. Do you know somebody else that's three and a half years old? What? You're three yeah. and a half years old. Yeah. And if I'm saying any questions from you? Um, um I like is is how many people are in um are in GitLab and like why are there so many? We have 160 people, and it's because we have a lot of work to do. But actually, we have even more work to do, so we're still hiring more. 